Okay, guys, can you, can you guys hear me? We're good? Okay. My name's Dr. Stefan. <clears throat> Thank you guys so much uh, for coming tonight. I do want to give you just a brief uh, rundown of what we're going to be doing uh, for the evening, okay? Um, we're going to be doing some door prizes all night. You guys got those little tickets. Uh, we're going to be giving away some pretty cool stuff. Um, we're going to actually be giving away an entire weight loss program uh, to somebody tonight, okay? So if you're not a current patient already um, and your name gets picked out of the hat, pretty cool. You guys can do the whole program for free, all right? Uh, we did that uh, back in January. It was, it was a, big, a big success, okay? Um, we are doing some special discounts for you guys in addition. So even if you do not win, you know, we still are going to offer you guys some, uh, you know, a nice little discount if you do decide to join up with us you know, down the road, okay? Um, and also, some of you guys are here with those little VIP tickets, those yellow tickets, all right? Make sure you guys, you know, bring those along to your uh, consultation or turn those in, okay? Because you guys get some special discounts, okay? Pretty cool. Um, and then we are talking about the other So, um, I'm going to go over just an overview, a quick overview of the program. I'm going to talk to a few of our wonderful patients uh, so you guys can hear uh, their story. Um, Dr. Williams is going to talk uh, for a few minutes. She's going to talk about um, some uh, reduction of prescription medication and how you know, weight loss uh, can achieve that. Um, Dr. Toon is going to talk about our super fancy red light machine uh, that you know, and he'll give you all the details there. Um, and after that, um, you're going to get a chance to speak with not only um, you know, myself and, and Dr. Toon and Dr. Williams, um, but also the patients that um, have done uh, great on the program, um, they're going to remain available. You guys can kind of ask them questions that maybe you wouldn't want to ask, you know, myself or somebody else, okay? Um, and then at the end of all of that, you know, then we'll be announcing uh, the winner of the free program, okay? Um, so there are some appropriate questions and some maybe some inappropriate questions. So don't ask about, you know, kind of personal health stuff. Don't ask about insurance. Don't ask about any of that kind of stuff, okay? <coughs> Just ask, like, hey, you know, uh, just the, the basic stuff, okay? Especially now with, with, with the patients. So, again, um, you know, I'm sure you guys have heard, um, you know, of us for quite some time. We've been doing this for a couple of years now. Um, this really is uh, just a, the, the best, you know, weight loss system that I've seen around, especially in central PA, okay? We have helped tons of people uh, literally lose tons of weight, 35,000, what is it, 35,917 pounds. We keep a running tally, you know, in the back. So quite a bit of weight, we have a lot of people. Um, you can lose weight very quickly on this program, um, or it can, it can be a little more steady. There really is no race, but just know that, you know, to get 30 pounds off, that often doesn't take, you know, as long as, as you think, okay? Um, so a couple questions. Um, so who in here wants to feel better than they do right now? You know, probably almost everyone, okay? Uh, who wants to function better on a day-to-day -day basis? So what does that mean? Uh, sleep better, move better, uh, exercise more, exercise at all, right? Um, have less joint pain, have more fun with their family. Uh, th this is a good one. Uh, somebody told me a couple weeks ago they want to be able to fit in the Phoenix at Canobos. They can't fit right now. That's one of their goals. When they have grandkids, they want to be able to hang out and play with them, okay? Um, those are those real reasons why you guys do programs like this. Um, and so you have to start somewhere, and you guys have all chosen uh, to take the time out of your, your busy schedule, and you're here tonight, okay? So, very, very important to understand uh, what we are not going to be doing with you, uh, just as much as what we are going to do with you. So, you are not, this is not a prescription uh, medication program, uh, fentramine, contrary, sex, and uh, uh, desoxin. Does anybody know what that desoxin is? It's methamphetamine, okay? So we're not going to be giving you meth to help you lose weight. Yay! <laughs> okay. um, we're not going to be recommending uh, gastric bypass, uh, HCG injections, I'm sure you guys have heard of that. Um, frozen and prepackaged food, that is a big one. Okay, that's, a, that, that's very popular. They have all kinds of advertising money to blast their message on TV, right? You're just eating the lean cuisines for six months, right? How exciting is that? Right, gotcha. So, we're not going to be counting calories, uh, tracking points, and this is certainly not going to be some sort of cabbage soup or pumpkin diet, I don't know why, you eat pumpkin for three months and you lose weight. Okay, this is a very normal, just easy way to do things, okay? Um, it, easy, it's gotta be easy or else you're gonna do what? You're gonna lose your attention and you're gonna go off and do other things. So, um, specifically, how we do things you know, on this program is we have to control your cravings and your hunger. How many people are just craving sugar and 
craving pasta and bread and you're just hungry too much and you're hungry an hour after you eat, right? That's a big problem. So we help you with some specific, um, easy to take supplements and by controlling your body's acidity level. So how acid or alkaline you are, okay? Not, I don't think any other programs do those types of things. We're gonna help you fight fatigue and boost your energy by boosting your body's natural hormone production. Okay, and that ties in with the next one to increase your metabolism just so you can lose weight in a more timely manner. Okay, so we boost the hormones, it boosts your energy, it stimulates your thyroid, it stimulates your hormones to work better so that you can lose weight easier. Um, and we do a full system uh, detox. Uh, most of, the most important uh, organs that we do hit are the intestines and the liver. Okay, um, so what does that get you? You feel less bloated, how many people are bloated? Acid reflux, um, how many people self diet I have IBS, right? You know, all, the, all that kind of thing. Um, so you'll feel less bloated, uh, and you'll be, by detoxifying your liver, you're gonna be able to process the fat out of your system uh, much easier, uh, much quicker, okay? So, um, essentially, we teach your body uh, to get away from using sugar, carbs, and starch as a fuel source, and we use our stored fat as energy so that we lose fat, right? That's what we want, we lose the fat, okay? So we teach your body to do that. So um, each of you guys have a, a, you know, a semi-customized program. A lot of you will start with you know, some similar uh, aspects and then things change kind of as we go and your progress uh, changes if we had to you know, you know, change things. We always do that because you'll meet with us you know, periodically, okay? Um, but specifically, one of the big problems that people have with weight loss programs is they don't know what to do. Okay, so we're gonna tell you exactly what to eat. We're gonna tell you how much of it to eat based on your body size, okay? I need more food than, you know, the slim young lady leaning against the table back there <laughs> needs, okay? So it's all adjusted for your, your body size. Um, we're gonna tell you what food groups to eat, what food groups are good and bad for you, uh, when to add the new food groups back on, okay? Um, we use some very uh, easy to take natural supplements. We give you a checklist. Um, it's really easy to follow along, okay? Um, you know, we'll give you exercise advice uh, when appropriate, but just understand this is a metabolic uh, program. This is all food-based. I do not care if you move a muscle ever, okay? You know, to a degree, you know, to get, to get the, you know, the weight off, all right? But down the road, you know, we can help you with when I think it's appropriate to exercise, you know, what's good for you and what may not be so great, okay? So um, the biggest uh, thing I think I want you to understand is when you leave us, you know, we will have taught you exactly what to do uh, to keep this weight off for good, okay? And you're gonna hear that from a couple of patients, you know, here in a little bit. They're gonna tell you, you know, you know how, how they've been able to keep their weight off. And, you know, I'm sure you guys, if you guys have checked this out at all on YouTube or the internet or whatever, you know, people are always talking about just lost the weight, I've kept it off, and, you know, they're still doing great. Okay, so that is one of the big things that I always have to make sure people understand is, you know, as soon as you, you know, when, when you're at your goal weight, uh, we're going to help you keep it off after that, okay? So, um, one of the things we wanted to also uh, teach you guys tonight are some things, some fundamental things that even if we never see you ever again, you'll be able to learn, you know, you'll, you'll, you'll take something home on from tonight. So one of the big problems with a lot of weight loss programs is they don't uh, teach you how to break through plateaus, okay? So there's some current uh, weight loss patients in the room, so you guys know about the apple days, right? The steak days, you know, how fun is it if you're stuck on a weight loss program? You get the excuse to get the grill out, go to the store, buy a nice steak about this big, and eat that, and that breaks your plateau. <coughs> Pretty cool, right? right? So that's one way. Uh, apple day is another way. You know, very, very simple thing. You have three, four, five, six apples throughout the day. Uh, just jump starts uh, that liver and gets the body uh, burning fat again, okay? So two things, if you if you were ever trying to lose weight, whether with us, we will hammer this home, you know, for you guys. And maybe, you know, you're doing something else. Uh, this will always help you, okay? Steak day, apple day. So steak day, you eat nothing all day nothing all day at all, then have a nice big steak for dinner, six, eight, 10, 12 ounces if you're a bigger guy, okay? Or apples, so you eat apples all day. You lose a pound or two the next day, three pounds sometimes, and um, the weight just you know, picks up and starts moving again, okay? Everything make, that makes sense? Good. So, uh, another very common misconception uh, is, you know, 
fat makes you fat. You know, eating these fatty foods, you know, makes you fat. So there's lots of fat in things like salmon, right? Does salmon make you fat? You know, probably not. There's lots of fat in like a ribeye steak or, you know, does that make you fat? What does make you fat? Processed food, uh, sugar, you know, simple sugars, uh, simple carbohydrates, uh, starches, things like that. So healthy fats, like things that are found in avocado, you know, the homemade guacamole that you can make at home, uh, fattier fishes, coconut oil, nuts, uh, almonds, walnuts, hazelnuts, pine nuts, all those good healthy fats in there, um, whole eggs, eat the yolk, eat every last yolk that you can, okay, that's so good for you. Good healthy fat, okay. Fat definitely does not make you fat, it's the sugar, it's the carbs, it's those processed foods, okay. That's number two. Number three, um, it kind of piggybacks off that last one, um, the three, you know, worst carbs to eat for weight loss. And sometimes people kind of get confused on what that is, so I just wanted to point that out. So like the refined sugars you find in sweets or candy, uh, you know, packaged stuff like that, you know, that most people know is not good for you. Uh, white flour, so things you find in bread, uh, pasta, white bread, whole wheat bread, that kind of thing, all right? And then the final thing is starch. Now starch isn't always bad, bad for you, okay? Everybody has a little different you know, tolerance for that. But when you're trying to lose weight in a timely manner, it just isn't the best thing for you, okay? So uh, just to piggyback off of that one, what are some good carbs for you uh, that won't necessarily you know, harm your weight loss, okay? People like oatmeal, anybody like oatmeal? So the best kind of oatmeal to have is the steel cut variety, okay? You find it right in the grocery store section, it's right by the instant stuff, okay? And it doesn't take that much longer to make, all right? Um, the reason it's better for you, and for all these things, it digests a little slower, okay? None of the carbs will spike your blood sugar, that's when things become bad, okay? So steel cut oatmeal, so switch from the, the instant, go to the steel cut, it pr literally tastes the same, okay? Um, sprouted grain bread. Have anybody heard of Ezekiel bread before? I know definitely my people in the back row, you guys know all about it, right? Ezekiel bread. Uh, it's a sprouted grain. Um, basically, the flour is not processed down to nothing and all the nutrients sucked out of it. You know, some of the digestive enzymes are left in there, so it actually remains pretty good for you, okay? It'll digest slower. It's not going to bloat your stomach. You're not going to be hungry an hour later. Okay, so Ezekiel bread, uh, you typically find that in the freezer section of the organic section. I don't know if it's, if it's even organic, but it kind of fits in with that realm of food. Okay, you find it in the freezer section, Walmart, Wise's, Giant, all, all the big Wegmans, they all have it, okay? And the final thing um, is some more slower digesting carbohydrates, quinoa, brown rice, uh, brown rice, uh, sweet potatoes, yams. And yams are actually a little better than sweet potatoes. Again, they're not gonna spike your blood sugar as much. Okay, so these carbs are okay. These carbs, no good. White flour, white potatoes, uh, white sugar. Okay, well, anything that's white, not good. Better carbs, steel cut oats, sprouted grain bread, quinoa, that kind of thing. Okay, so the choice really from here is, is you guys. Okay, um, who do you want to be? You want to be this person? Okay, does she look happy? She's like forcing a smile, just a tiny bit. Of that person. Or do you want to be this person, right? I think that's like 45 pounds. Here or here. Why did you guys see the big difference there? Okay, this was in three and a half, maybe four months time. Okay, you gained 40, 45 pounds. She's just a regular 40-ish year old lady. Okay, I was a stay-at-home mom, right? So the, the choice is literally you guys. You can choose to stay this way, or you can take some action and 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 mix these incredible improvements uh, to your life, uh, to your health, okay? So, uh, just a quick reminder on, on the weight loss program, on, on the free program that we're gonna give out tonight. So in order to qualify, can't be a current patient, okay? And you just have to schedule an, a consultation to come in and see us at some point. And then later on tonight, we're gonna have, uh, have our big drawing, okay? All that makes sense? Okay, I'm gonna bring up my first power couple of the evening. Laverne, Stephanie, you guys are up first. <laughs> so, Levert was actually our big famous winner from January. We did this exact same event uh, back in January. And so he lost 45? 58. 50. <laughs> <laughs> well, come over here so I can get you. So, 
58 pounds in since January 5th, right? Because you came the day after uh, we started, I believe. So why don't you just kind of tell your story? Uh, how did you feel beforehand? How do you feel now? What are you looking for for the future? My name is Levert Rice, and I'm an alcoholic. I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I this was AA. I apologize. <laughs> out. No, uh, I, I was actually you guys sitting here. Uh, never won nothing in my life. Uh, a friend of mine who's actually in the back now, who's done a fantastic job at losing weight, actually posted something on Facebook, and I seen it. And I was just like, wow. Because at this point, I was in my 40s. I felt like everything was going downhill, and I had refused to be like my aunt and my grandmother and my grandfather, who died at an early age. Uh, obviously, with, with be, getting older, your metabolism slows down. And so I had a, an entourage of things going on. Became a type 2 diabetic, which I had dreaded. And uh, so I, I was just kind of disappointed. I, I bought a, a bike from Walmart. And I thought by spending three hundred dollars for it, it would, it would actually help me. And I lost about ten pounds in like two months, which really wasn't a whole lot, but it was a start. And I seemed stuck at that, so I was very depressed about getting smaller. So, as, as you can see, so as time went on, and I seen those photos, I actually contacted her and her husband. He was a young man I had actually played softball with for a number of years, and I was just amazed at her pictures. And she told me, "Hey, come out tonight." So I said something to my wife, who's very yeah, just always got something to say. And I'm just like, come with me, man. Just come with me. And I love her to death, but she's the, the other half of wh why this combination works the way it does 17 years in the making. Um, so moving forward, I came this night just like you guys did. And uh, I, I felt like the Pennsylvania lottery winner, <laughs> to be honest with you. The young lady in the back called my name and my jaw literally dropped to the floor. And I'm like sitting there like this and my daughter goes, Dad, you won? I'm like, I did. I'm like, are you guys serious? And I was like, yeah, you won. I was like, wow. So fast forward, four months now, 58 pounds down, man. And one of the benefits to it all was I'm actually off my metformin, no longer a type two diabetic. And that was the greatest thing that I could have ever heard in my life. So thanks to these guys. Thanks for, you know, your stick to itiveness as well as my own. And uh, I'll pass the mic to my wife now.